Okay, I've been working like three jobs. Probably why I never see ya. Probably why I never have time for the fake friends I won't be ya. Oh God, I've been running now. Right, you lot. We're back. We're back with another video. And it is day number four. And by the title of this video, you'll probably know already what I'm about to tell you. But basically, I'm dealing with what I would call my first injury of the trip. And it almost made me not go to training this morning. But something happened. A phenomenon happened. And it's a phenomenon I'm aware of, but uh, you know, I wasn't, wasn't uh, sure if, if I should test it or not, but I did. And that is the fact that once you're actually into a training session, you almost forget about pain, any pain you're experiencing. Once you actually finish, once your heart rate comes down, once you stop sweating, that's when you notice it again, and that's exactly what's happened. So basically, guys, I'm struggling with my Achilles tendon. Yesterday morning, we trained eight to 10. After that, I actually came back here and made a video. And then after that, I started realizing that, holy shit, man, I can't even walk. Um, you know, my Achilles tendon is extremely aggravated. It's extremely inflamed. And, um, you know, I think that's just from bouncing around, using my calves, using my, my very tight calves. I feel like my tight calf muscle is actually affecting um, my Achilles. So this morning I did some calf stretches. It kind of relieved it a tiny bit. I headed down to training. All good. Sweet. We're done. Now, I went to the pharmacy and got some treatment. I said, look, do you have any ice packs? Because this place is so hot, it's like if you ask someone for ice and you try and take it back to your room, it's honestly going to be melted by the time you get there. So, they've given me something I've never used before, but we're going to use it right here, right now, on camera. And that is called Ice Spray. So, I'm sure professional athletes out there are familiar with, with something similar to this, but I'm not. So, uh, it's throbbing right now. And I'm expected to go down for my first one-on-one -on -one private session this afternoon. You know, depending on how I feel. So I'm hoping that this stuff actually helps. We've got some anti-inflammatories as well. Ten, to be exact. Um, so, your guess is as good as mine, but let's, let's try it. He said it lasts for like, well I said does it last for 5 minutes, he said longer, longer. I said okay, so it might be 10, might be 15, might be 20. I'll give it a bit more. Oh yeah, that's the shit. Okay, so we'll see how that goes, I'll take it anti-inflammatory. Um, today is a day of firsts actually, not, not firsts in my life, but firsts in this trip. We've got three firsts, um, actually four firsts. The first one is my injury. The second one is I just got my first lot of laundry done. And as you can see, it's all nicely folded in a bag, ready for me to pick up, and it cost me a total of 60 baht, which is $3. So you can't complain with that. Another first for this trip, I actually got a protein shake. And uh, you know, it was probably one of the most hardest things in the world for me to do, to not drink this on the spot but I saved it so I could bring it back and show you. And look what they've got. They've got these little carry bags, which is quite, quite neat, I thought. So uh, what have we got in here? A scoop of chocolate protein. We've got some ice, milk, and banana. And this cost me a total of 80 baht, which is four Australian dollars. And uh, the fourth first thing of the day is going to be that one-on-one -on -one session. So I've already cleared uh, me being able to bring down the camera. It's going to be at five o'clock this afternoon. Man, I don't know. I don't know if this has worked or not. I'm going to put some more on there. It's going to be at five o'clock this afternoon, five till six. It's going to be with uh, this guy Ali, who was the first guy I introduced myself to. And it's funny, you know, when you come to a new place like this, you know, like that. <laughs> Tiger, Tiger Muay Thai. Um, you know that that uh, that first 
interaction you have with a trainer or with, with a local is always going to stick with you. It's a real first impression kind of thing. And I, I saw, I went over to him and I, I introduced myself and said, my name's Jacob, what's yours? And his name's Ali. It could have been any of the trainers, but it was him for whatever reason. And I've been down there four times now for, for group sessions and he always picks me out to come and do pads with him. He has kind of, I would say, taken me under his wing and I feel really, really comfortable with him. And so he's telling me, you know, I really need to get into these one-on-one -on -one sessions. I don't know if it's because he wants the money or it's because he really believes in me, but I'm going to do it and I'm going to take the camera down. So that's going to be video number five for the trip. And it's going to be the first time that you guys have an opportunity to see me uh, actually practice Muay Thai. So I can't wait. I'm going to rest up, have my protein shake, have another coffee, have a, have a nice lunch, watch as much coverage as I can on the upcoming uh, heavyweight championship fight between Wilder and Fury, which is on this weekend. We've got UFC Auckland this weekend with Dan Hooker fighting Paul Felder. Uh, there's a couple of other New Zealanders on that card as well. So look, man, basically this week has been <laughs> training, eating, relaxing, and watching fights, watching the fight game, watching interviews, watching old fights. I'm watching The Ultimate Fighter. I'm, I've got UFC Fight Pass. I'm always watching that. I'm always watching interviews on fights. I fucking love the fight game. I love it. I'm absolutely obsessed. And as I mentioned before, there's one goal. One big goal that if I, re if, if I, if I, <sighs> this is so important to me, but it's not something I want to talk about until it's actually happened. But if I can have my first ever fight, that will be me facing my biggest fear. It's not spiders. It's not snakes. Well, it's probably sharks, but look, my biggest fear when it comes to man on man is being in a fight. I've been cracked in the face a couple of times back in high school. I was always too scared to fight back. Too fucking scared. This trip is about confidence, but if I can actually get in there and have an amateur fight by the time I leave Thailand, you will not be able to wipe the smile off my face. So that is what we're working towards. But that's not something you're going to hear about for probably another month. In the meantime, you've got plenty of reaction videos to enjoy. I'm going to chill out guys, it's been 8 minutes, um, I hope you're all doing well, I hope you're having a fantastic day. So look, you know this video is um, just an update, I feel like it's going to be part of a, a whole series of videos that are going to come out, I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to title them, but it's going to be something along the lines of my Tiger Muay Thai experience, day 1, day 2, day 3, day 4, and this next video guys is, is one I'm really looking forward to making, and it's going to be... It's going to be humbling, of course, um, slowly but surely. I'm getting my stance right. I'm getting blocking right. Elbows down, not up like this. Things like that. And I'm sure I'm going to actually learn the most I ever have in this one-on-one -on -one session. So I can't wait. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Peace out. From Phuket, Thailand. Fuck. Guys, i got to be honest, man. I don't know if this is going to work. <laughs> um... Yeah, quick update, man. This is about half an hour later. I, I, I don't know. If, I don't know if we're gonna make it, man. My Achilles is is killing me. My Achilles is killing me. Ironically. Ah! Oh. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. But I, I dare say that the same thing will happen that happened this morning. And that is, I'll completely forget about it. So, I'll see you later.